Under the new law, the NSA's controversial bulk metadata collection program will be modified. Information about phone numbers called and the duration of those calls will no longer be maintained by the NSA. That information will be stored by phone companies. And the court that oversees sensitive U.S. surveillance programs will become somewhat more transparent. Some decisions will now be declassified, and the court will hear from specially designated privacy advocates while making sensitive decisions. Backers of the law say these changes plus other minor tweaks are the right approach. We passed the most significant surveillance reform in decades. Uh, we've done it by setting aside ideology, setting aside fear mongering, said so we will protect the security of the United States, but we also protect the privacy of Americans. In the years after the terrorist attacks on September 11, 2001, U.S. spy agencies were given massive powers to investigate and head off future terror plots. But after Edward Snowden revealed the existence of some of these programs, privacy advocates pushed back. Snowden reacted from Russia, where he's living in asylum. We've lost this one surveillance program, which everyone agreed was illegal and ineffective. Uh, is that enough? Is that the change we need? Is that everything that's going to happen? And of course, the answer is no. It's not enough. The new law will be implemented over the next six months.